He brawler, his oh, Joker, yeah. his Lucario. <laughs> You know, it just he bust out Isabel at the mango. Like, oh, that's right. Yeah, we saw that. It was, it was actually pretty wild. He won, you know, won and then switched right back off. But yeah, Sue just super deep pocketed characters. You know, uh, let's see what he can do with Joker. Yeah, um, I, I feel like with Lucario, any matchup where it's like you're a fast character that combos really hard and kills really early, it can be yeah. really tough for Lucario because Lucario is a character that strives off of like getting a lot of rage. So characters like Fox or Falcon. I feel like can kind of put a damper to that strategy because, like, well, I'm just going to obliterate you because I'm just like a glass cannon. Yeah. Any character that can just, you know, consistently kill him, low, you know, lower ones. Because Lucario, for all his strengths, he is quite slow. Oh, yeah, for sure. But, of course, Joker, um, we've seen much success with MK Leo uh, winning back-to-back -back S tiers with this character. So we know this character can do it. Yeah. Now, what I'm interested really to see is that I know uh, a lot of Jokers, including Sue, they, they love to use the... Uh, uh, the down beat, right? Well, I think it's Rebel's Guard. Uh, oh, right, right. When they're, they love to use it when they're recovering, when they don't have uh, a, a uh, when they don't have it. And I think Falcon up, you will just command grab it out, you know? Oh, yeah. So and I mean, just having a really strong command or just even a kill grab is going to be so good against Rebel's Guard. Oh, yeah. And I mean, right now, uh, look at, oh, oh, Falcon kicking out of the corner, <laughs> not quite getting it, but Fatality is showing his, his signature brand of yeah. Falcon. Yeah, exactly. Another oh, Falcon. Oh, another one. Oh, trying to get the up. I like yeah. that because he goes back on the stage. Really, really oh, smart. Up Almost getting it, honestly. On the cross of DI, yeah. Back throw okay. setting up off stage situation here. Sue utilizing his gun. I feel like that down gun is gonna be so good. The rainstorm coming in for Sue. It's gonna it's just gonna be so good against Fatality. Oh the dash tag. Dash tag being a kill move now. It's crazy to me. Oh yeah, for sure. And I, I actually think it's so good. Ooh, he oh, tried yeah. to move back here in a Raptor boost. That would have been so much. I heard you can do like almost anything out of Raptor boost. Really? Like, these lower percents with low rage. He has high rage oh, right now, so his Rebels guard right there to get to get into his uh, up tilt. Yeah, I mean when you're Arsene, anything kills. Like realistically. <laughs> have you ever, did you see that Sylvanas video with uh, Arsene? Yes. Uh, dude, it's so funny. <laughs> Don't worry about it, man. Everything kills. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Sabonis, man. He's a, he's a homie. He makes great content. If you haven't seen him, um, go ahead and check him out on Twitter and YouTube. But uh, right now, Sue had a pretty big deficit, honestly. Yeah, I mean, it, you know, Fatality just been kind of been using his just running running around him, you know, using his speed just so much to like punish him. It he gets him in situations, gets you know, and this goes for all of his He gets people in situations like that and just keeps the pressure on the back air, the up bees. Oh man, and yeah, and I, I love. I love Fatality's usage of up, be out of shield. So, so strong. Up and over, gets the force match. And that's one thing Fatality was known for in Smash 4 is how well he could recover with Ooh. Falcon. Sue's just taking two of those, taking them both, but, you know, I now feel he has like, it. I feel like Sue couldn't rock croc in that situation because he wanted to hold down to make sure he didn't get untechable. Yeah. Because if you hold up and tech, you'll tech wall jump. But you also, if you hold up on a move, you get increased knockback, so it might actually make it so it's untechable. Okay. Oh, what is it? Down tilt. How is he alive Ooh, right now? Yeah. Like, he he is, sur look at this! Yeah. He is not getting gimped by Arsene Joker. That is absolutely phenomenal. Oh, I'm just, I'm just gonna take it. What? Wow. Yeah, I feel like he did not, he just didn't, you know, he was gonna do a lot of damage with Arsene Joker, but he did not capitalize with those kills. Oh, are you oh, dead? Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy that he was at zero and we're actually scared for his life. I mean, that's oh. Falcon in a nutshell. Get the reset. Oh, it parry, oh. parries it, but doesn't get a punish. Oh, man. If that knee connected, though. Oh, up tilt killing again. Oh, he's it. All right, kind of waiting out the Arsene. That's kind of like ha hashtag meta, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Don't blame him one bit. Arsene, super hard to deal with. And this is a situation you don't want to be as Joker. You're at around 100% and no Arsene to be found. He just dipped. Where are you at, man? You kind of, kind of need him right now. <laughs> I need you. you know, it's, he, he needs the arsenal right now. He is not in a very good situation without it. Oh, the LP. He uses that so well. Oh, doesn't kill. Dude, it like locks on, too. Like, he was pretty far away. Like, I feel like yeah. that could have covered ledge roll as well. What's the ledge trap here? Fatality trying to get the jump. I think the back, back throw will do No, it doesn't. Wow, dang. I think one more grab. I think up throw will do it now. Yeah, yeah. But any more on stage. Can you make something happen with Arsene? Arsene, bail me out, man. Arsene! No, it doesn't look like ah. it's just like right off the top. <laughs> Arsene coming on into play and then going right back out. Very, very phenomenal gameplay coming out from Fatality at game number one. And don't be fooled. That Falcon recovery is 
garbage. But Fatality <laughs> is just he really, really good at it. Makes it look good. He definitely makes it look good. And it's just crazy because Joker's definitely one of those characters that, I mean, it's not as crazy as Bayonetta holding Nair off stage, but like, it's definitely kind of on that caliber of like, you're really, you have really good tools to covering characters with really low recoveries. Oh, yeah. And like, man, we saw Fatality recover against Bayonetta in Smash 4. This is probably a breeze for him. Oh, yeah. All right, so All right. what do you think? Sue, you know, obviously. I, yeah, I, I don't think he's comfortable enough with the Joker. Like, I mean, it was last stock, but I, I feel like it was convincing enough for to like justify a switch for sure. Well, it looks like he's going back to the Joker. Really? Yeah, surprising Dang. to me, but. I, I, de I definitely feel like you, you almost just try the Lucario because you're comfortable with it, but I'm not Sue right now, so maybe he's just feeling comfortable. Maybe he's kind of like, all right, you know what? I'm going to change this up. I'm going to change up how my games are. I'm going to change up my neutral, and I'm going to go confident into this game number two. Yeah. All right. Going back to FD. Yeah, right. FD, definitely a stage where going high, um, definitely not as justified. You don't have any uh, platform mix-ups. And oh, that's right, so I, good. So I think it's after three spins, wow. you can uh, you can then cancel into an aerial. And we talked about how good Fatality was at recovering. Finally, Sue is going to abuse that down good and combine it with the forward smash as well. Get that first stock. Very, very clean edge guard coming out from Sue. Oh, yeah. Sue, Sue made that look like you know, he made it look stupid for even saying that. It's like, oh, he's so good at it. But Sue just consistently three times pushed yeah. him off, F smashed him. And you know what's crazy, too? Like, he didn't even use Arsene to get the first stock. So now he's playing on the second stock with a fresh Arsene. I mean, Arsene is about to leave right now, but, I mean, just getting a lot of mileage in general. Ooh, there's a drag down. Uh, I think there's a drag down right there. Oh, the wow. upbeat is taking it, you know, going too deep and getting caught by that. And I love how Fatality, when he goes in like that, he'll reverse the upbeat. So if he does get the grab, he can possibly get the soccer and offstage situation here. Yeah, he's so good at utilizing that part of the recovery. Oh yeah, and we've we've seen him utilize it since Smash 4 and oh yeah, and whatever other games he played before Smash 4 as well. Here's the jab, and just like that, we see Falcon being a very explosive character, and Fatality has brought this back right into his favor. Oh, now, oh, oh again, just always doing so well to angle that. And, and All right. Just how he's positioning himself around the down gun. He knows that's what Sue wants. And there it is he again. He catches the tether. Where you at, man? You're trying to edge guard me. Actually, actually, uh, <laughs> you're going to have to exit left. Ooh. All right. Well, this is definitely not a situation he wants to. Oh, misses the F smash, too. You know, that, I think that always feels the worst when you miss the punish that is basically free. Dang, man. Oh, catches the. Dude, it. Fatality putting Falcon back on the map right now? Man. I mean, you kind of got to shout out Sakurai too, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. He was the one who really put Falcon back on the map. But yeah, I mean, Fatality definitely um, someone who... Oh, Ooh, the stop me. Get, I, I think that was low-key a message that the, the Joker's got to go. I yeah. think the Joker might have to go, bro. You know, but who, but, yeah, who does he use? Maybe, maybe one of his Mii's, like... Lucario, I feel like, struggles so much against Falcon. You can I, put him disadvantage once. That's it for you. True. Yeah. And it, it, it's a tough pick, but it's like, what do you pick? Like comfort? You know what I mean? Like I don't know how much he's been playing Lucario in this iteration, but it was pretty much his main since Smash Four. Looks like we're gonna see the comfort pick, the nod coming out from Fatality. This is exactly what he wanted. Let's see how this goes. Let's see if. Sue can survive the onslaught known as Fatality's Falcon Man, and it's been definitely getting worse. It was kind of close, but game two was such a shutout. We saw, I mean, pretty much getting a kill at 40% with the stomp into the knee. Oh, yeah. You know, it, it's going to be the same kind of thing here. It's, you know, like, as soon as he gets put in a situation where he has to up B back to stage or up B, you know, that's when he's really in danger. All right, so, of course, these lower percent combos, especially with uh, no aura on Lucario. So, Lucario, uh, pretty much a character that the more damaged you are, the more percent you do and the more knockback you have yeah. so definitely a character that can do some crazy comeback jesus oh man okay fatality oh, really trying to style right now <laughs> well that's the problem you know when you play lucario if you got us if he got that stock taken so early you are such a it's such a difficult situation to take it to do anything until you get more damage on you right lucario definitely a character that strives off of having that percentage Ooh. and falcon definitely someone that can melt the per or melt the stocks off without too much damage on your opponent Ooh, right Ooh. back here Actually catches him on the platform. Jeez, how strong is that move? Lucario back air, definitely one of the stronger back airs. Combined with the aura mechanic as well, can be so so devastating. You know, 100% Lucario. That's you know, that's that's some aura. You know, you're gonna he's gonna be doing some damage. Oh yeah, I mean, just like a little aura sphere right there to 23. Man, already 46% on to Fatality. 
Ooh, canceling that into a grab. Ooh, the down air. Are you? That was the double jump. Uses the wall jump, though. Very oh. crafty stuff. But now, man. Now, one of the things he used. Oh, so good. He is so good with that neutral beat. Dang, man. Fatality kind of getting bodied. Bibbity bop this game number three. And I mean, the Lucario is out to play, and he's holding on to this aura. And we talked about how this could be a little rough for Lucario, but if you can hold on to the stock, if you can hold on yeah. to the aura. As soon as you put in disadvantage, lose that stock. But as long as he can hold it, if he has that aura, it's so good. Okay, yeah. back to the low aura here. Going to be doing a little less damage, but Sue still willing to go off stage versus Captain Falcon. You got to abuse the recovery. You got to be able to get those gimps on the Falcon. Okay, getting caught in a little combo here, Sue's in a really dead? bad position. Oh. <laughs> My man, Fatality, just put, put him in the combo video. But man, get him on the highlight reel. That was a very clean conversion. And the platform extension into the forward air? That Jeez. was so clean by Fatality. He just he knew exactly what he had to do to get back in, the, back in this game. He did it. Man, Falcon can still do some crazy you know, stuff. Here's the thing is, you know, and until until Sue gets more damage on him, it's going to be very hard to kill Falcon. Yeah, it definitely, uh, Lucario, definitely not a character that plays, like, oh, incredibly he's scared. He doesn't want to get caught by it again. Oh, no. Not, oh. oh. Yo, yo, Fatality oh, tried to okay. instill the fear in him and get, like, some kind of defensive option. Oh, gets him with the downer. He's going to kill him. Oh, that was so good. Yes, yes. He knew exactly where Fatality wanted to go. And, I mean, honestly, we've seen Fatality with a lot of mix-ups going, like, kind of into the stage. But when you have those walls, you do have the wall jump, but you don't have that space to work with that yeah, Fatality so, was working so with. So he knows exactly where the exact line is to go drop down right exactly. there and catch him with the down air. Because how many times before have we seen Fatality kind of like recover very deep in and reverse the up against yeah. socks like that? You can't really do that on uh, Kalos, but you do have the wall jump mix up. Yeah, it was it was Sue's counter pick. I think it's mostly because Lucario can do the wall like stick, yes. plant, whatever. You know, just because he needs everything he can get to mix up that recovery. Oh yeah, for sure. But man, what an explosive set we have here. Fatality versus Sue. And man, we just saw a crazy combo that last game, man. Yeah, we're gonna, I mean, might as well stick with the Lucario at this point. <laughs> yeah, you know, I don't see a reason to switch. <laughs> it just tried to, it's just, you know, his favorite character. Tried and All true, right. man. Sometimes, sometimes even though the matchup isn't in your favor, you got to kind of go with the comfort pick, you know what I mean? <laughs> the grabs in the same direction. All right. Ooh, okay, get some damage. You know, only only 35 of all that, but, you know, it's just because he doesn't have aura. Oh, yeah, exactly. And I mean, that it's just so crazy how dependent his moves Damage outputs right. are with the aura. Vitaly doesn't go for anything further than that. I thought he was going to try and just go for the knee. Yeah. So one, so one of the other things I really think is really neat is that, uh, and he sort of used it huh. a little bit in the last match. Right. When you charge aura in the air. Oh. Ooh, perfect angle. Efficient hook that, man. Went up and around. But now Sue's uh, jacked up with some aura. And uh, now Vitaly's got to respect some The back is so clean. Yeah, and that move is so strong. Cross stage, no hope. Obliterated, man. And now we got the low percent aura combos, and this is where the the snowball factor of Lucario can come in. Either you take the first stock and you're super behind because you have no aura, or like you're gonna prime up that second stock because yeah. you have so much aura. You just your combos are so oh, much. Catching that jump with the back air, vitality. You know he knows. He, you know whenever, whenever he wants to get like an early percent kill because that is just the best thing to get on Lucario. You do not want to get those higher percents. Oh, oh first he's go first knee. Okay, keeping the pressure right. on Fatality. Still keeping this combo game oh, up. Oh, this is scary. Oh, down air. Wow, Sue going right along the stage, just getting missed by that down air. You know, this is this is incredibly even right now, but oh, Sue, that is so important for him because now yeah. he has some more to play with. Exactly, and I mean, we talked about it. Oh, oh man, but it, it's so important that Sue gets uh, gets the first off. Whoever. Gets the first song, obviously very important, but there's certain matchups where it's like even more so important. Oh, Mario, yeah. very, very, very important. Okay. Oh. There's the jab pressure coming out from Fatality. What's he actually has here? not hit him. Oh, wow. Ooh, that, oh, that's so unfortunate. He bonked off the stage. Oh, that angle was so pretty, but he just yeah. barely missed it. Oh, going. that was such a good angle. He's going all over the place with these upbeats. Okay. Sue, despite all the, you know, all the, all the fancy angles he's got, Still, can we put back in a situation where it's last stock? Yeah, I mean, this is huge for Fatality. You do not want to be, like, in a Game 5 nervous situation against Lucario. Just in general, I feel like Lucario is definitely that character that's better in tournament than friendly because, like, the nerves are on, right? Oh, it's yeah. It's a very, uh, very uh, nerve-wrecking character to fight against because of just the aura mechanic being a thing. Oh, yeah. 
He goes, you know, Wario, Lucario, Little yes, Mech. Yeah. People you do not want to be in the last stock situation against. Right. Oh, man. But the stomps, we got the combo starters coming out here for Fatality. Oh, shoot, moving. Get some damage. Okay, there's the roll. I mean... I like Sue kind of slowing things down, just getting some aura charge here. The knee! Oh, that was so close to hitting. Oh, man. Fatality. Such a scary <laughs> situation to be in, Sue. And I mean, Sue hasn't really been doing the air dodge too much, but bringing it out right when he needs it, man, against that knee. Now, Sue really wants to take this to that game five. All right, bad situation to be in, Sue. Oh! Are you get dead? No! Oh, gets the bounce, but he doesn't catch the air dodge after Sue is able to live. For this game five uh, or game four, last time oh, last situation. Tag. This is so tense. Oh, oh he's I doing some fancy it. movement on him. Yeah, just re really mixing it up. All no right. double jump though. Super scary. Oh, go straight to the ledge. There's a clean angle. Up B, it doesn't get the kill. Up air, almost gets it off the top here for fatality. Oh, that was just. So there, yo, man, you gotta watch oh, the neutral B. It's just so. Man, right now Sue's winning. It's actually kind of wild. Oh. There's Aura Sphere, dash attack. Oh, he tried oh, to get he him tried the... to get it. The, 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 uh, the... Yeah, the down air into the side beat is a mix up. Sue just charging that. Oh, he catches, barely catches his foot. Sue wow. taking that game. That was super close. Him taking a breath. Dude, both players are just like, what is going on? The Aura Sphere being bigger actually anti aired <laughs> fatality. It yes. was. That's the crazy thing about, especially like Aura, right? The moves do more damage, they have more knockback, and they even have more range on some of the special moves. The neutral B, the side B, it's actually wild. So, you know, he really kept his nerves together. I was able to pull it out. <laughs> All right, so game four, very, very close. Is Sue going to get the reverse 3 on? I mean, this is the scary thing about game number five. If you're on the receiving end of getting reverse 3 on, you're like, dang, man, I was up 2-0, though. Like, yeah. I had this in the bag, though. But, like, of course, Fatality, a very seasoned player, very experienced player. He's been in this situation before. He knows what he has to do to close this out. But it's just so scary being up against Lucario in this situation. Especially. Oh, yeah. I mean, Fatality, you know, the men's, his mental game, you know, he's got to have you super on point right now. He's, he has none of the momentum currently. You know, it... Especially after, you know, last game, there was a couple opportunities where he probably could have taken it. He just kind of flubbed some things. But if there's right. one thing Falcon can do as a character is put momentum back in your side. This character, very, very explosive and uh, very, very crazy combo game and has very uh, crazy setups that can kill very early. Okay, he's going for the knee. He really wants that early kill. Oh, he gets it! Man. This is a terrible situation to be in as Lucario. Lucario will not be able to do any damage until he gets a little more. Right, exactly. And, I mean, what an opener. What a hard read. We saw Sue getting very creative with those upbees, but Fatality stopping it right in the tracks here. Wow, he catches the jump immediately. Just goes back. Now, and given, you know, he had stage one aura just for stock. But that's usually not enough. But, he, you know, he recognizes that and just goes for a gimp instead of actually going for an outright kill. Yeah, exactly. So clean. Sniping out that uh, double jump. Oh, okay. Oh, definitely. going high. Actually, only getting punished for the jab. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, better Sue than will dying. Take that. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's get Sue just trying to make some distance here, slow it down just a tad bit. And man, the air drift coming out from Lucario, especially combined with that B reverse, so nasty. Oh, oh we're man. missing that. Yeah, Fatality definitely trying to get these early stocks, and like we said, time and time again, this that is. The strategy here against Lucario. There's the up out of shield. He's, so you try and find a way to punish these fastball nares. And whenever, every time uh, Sue fastball nares in neutral, you know, a lot of times last games he was just kind of jumping or getting away from him. This game, you know, he's got the grabs on it. He just, you know, he did, uh, whenever Sue crossed him up with it, he was able to up be backwards out of shield. Like yeah. he, he's, he's really trying to find some options of these things. Yeah, Nair one. Ooh, that was so scary. Oh, man, there's a stomp. But yeah, Falcon does have confirmed off of the single hit Nair before he hits the ground, so. Definitely see Fatal. Oh, whoa! Oh, getting F smash for the Falcon Punch. But he did it for the fans, right? Uh, <laughs> maybe. I, I'm, I'm going to go out and say that was a, probably an input error. But you know what? If he uh, if he did the cojones on this man, I respect yeah. it. I, You know, I'm in his corner. I'm going I'm to say, you know, he did it for the fans. He did it for the fans, man. You, you know? But at what cost? Oh, oh evening it back up. That was Shoot. so huge. Because he needed to take that aura off. Yeah. If he didn't, like, he was actually in kill percent at 60%. Oh, yeah. Back air would have killed at the ledge. So now, now oh, Fatality. Gonna catch him. <laughs> oh, gonna catch Oh. I, I love how well a lot of Lucario's just kind of, you know, falter in their play until they get to, to a higher percent. Yeah. But Sue plays so well at these lower percents. He doesn't need the aura. Oh, oh he was going for something right there. Fatality kind of in a sticky situation. 
needs to get this percentage back. He might be able to get some kind of rage set up, get the stock earlier. Um, right now, Sue's not too much aura, so, so I, I, I believe at, the, you know, at certain percentage right here, if he doesn't have much aura, he can do up throw up air. Okay. Reset. Ooh. Oh, man. He almost got the knee there, but a little too far off because of the DI. Sue trying to close out this Ooh, stock. is that? No, it's not going to be it. Not enough That's aura. so close. Just the edge guard. Gets the tech. Into the upbeat. Fatality. He got stuck Still alive. In... Oh, oh, he got stuck in the... What? Sue pulling it out. Reverse 3-0. Wow, and Fatality is actually tripping out because he's like, dang, he was able to sidestep the grab there. Shambles. Wow, and uh, yeah, I mean, Sue's been doing that. If you get a certain like ground bounce off of the upbeat, you are able to immediately buffer spot dodge. You essentially have no lag, and uh, definitely catching a lot of people off guard there. Fatality definitely caught off guard, and Sue kind of saving it for that game five situation when he needed it the most. I am so impressed in. by Sue's nerves.